We're open tomorrow, 10.30 to 8 tomorrow. You're welcome. So listen, uh, we talked about doing the back room over, meeting your mom. So I'm gonna need a little assistance. You're gonna be around on your day off? Probably not. It's my day off. I have a lot of things to do. I have to go to Sam's Club in the morning. Well, I need you here because, you know. I know, and it's my day off, and... Well, yeah, I don't care about that. I think you can handle it without me. Just be there. That's all I got to say. I'll put it in my appointment, but... I'll be looking for you to be there. Make sure you... Yeah, call my secretary. Not for your wisecracks. Beautiful. Isn't it nice to get out and be in a wave of the store and experience the new horizons, take some time off yes. and get inspiration? Yes. It's the window washer. <laughs> Sound nice. Hey. Hey. Kimberly sent me this picture. She wants me to make the back room look like Max. By the time she gets back, three days, I don't know, not enough time. But whatever could be done, I'll try. Maybe our back room will look like the vault when we get back. I can only hope. All right. It's supposed to be 11 o'clock. What the heck? Your mom is gonna like it? I think you should put a plasma um, TV up there. We'll Why do we need a TV? We, we had to work. So We're here to work. We should get some hooks and put hooks on the walls and put, hang the ladders up. So I'm going to tie a noose around here and hang myself one day. Why would you do that? Then I want to have a father. Right, son. You'll be cashing in on my life insurance. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited to see Matt. Something really, yes. really special. Come on. Come, way. come, please come. Oh my God! What are these bad boys? Oh my God! Yes. It's a traditional Indian dress worn by a woman in India, and it looks really elegant on. Oh my oh, that's God! Gorgeous. It's gorgeous. I can't even imagine. <laughs> it's the finest silk, hand embroidered, done in India, especially for you guys. Oh my God! For Max's party, we're gonna wear traditional Indian saris. We've never worn anything like this. You'll show us how to put this on. And I'm going to no. show you. Yes. Yeah. And you ladies, get ready, and get ready I'll see you later at the party. OK. All right, bye. Boys out. Boys, Boys out. out. The most important thing of tying a sari, drawstrings must be really tight. OK. Otherwise, if it's loose, you lose it. You know, we have a service called Fluff Me, and we basically go to, like, a bride's house, and we dress the bride in her gown. I feel like this is what you're doing for me. All right, you're special. You're special. You're next. Oh, you look so yeah, pretty. Yeah, see how pretty that she looks? Oh, that came out so We're nice. gonna make you pretty just like her. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Take care of my sister. Of course I'm going to. This is gonna come, the final drape comes from the back now. Oh. Oh, All right. Beautiful. Oh my God, I'm next. My, you look good in red. My red sari was gorgeous. When she put it on and wrapped me around in there and did the henna on my leg. Look at this artwork, my God. I felt I was Indian. Go you, go you, go you, go you, go you. Do we pull it off? <laughs> Amazing. Let's go party. Let's go. Let's go. Fabulous food. Fabulous. Only the best. Fabulous Only the best. Everything is great. Food is great. Dancing's great. We look great. It makes you stand like. <laughs> Proud, proud, right? Yes. Max's party is unbelievable. He made us feel so welcome. I can't wait to go home and have my own family dinner with my family. 
the trip to Chicago really just inspired me and it's given me so many more thoughts and ideas of how I want to expand the business. Ringo, Ringo, Ringo! Just came back from our Chicago trip, and I came a little early to see what Sally Boy did in the back room to make our life easier. What are we doing with all these gowns still out here on the refs? I got gowns everywhere. I don't even know how we're going to get to them. And what are you going to hang up there? Yeah, that. We got to transfer some of those dresses on right. short dresses. So we thin them out a little so we could see a little better. Who's going to lift all these gowns? I'm not. I'll get a hire a monkey to come up there and... Well, then we're going to hire somebody just to stay back here. This was all your idea. Even if you do what they want, tell them what they want to hear, there's no pleasing them anyway. Fine. They'll find fault in something. There's no pleasing them. Back to work. How we doing? Making progress? What do you think? So far, so good. Uh, is this too low? No, no, we are low. Where are we gonna put in the sky? I need somebody to. What are you doing? We thought we were gonna come back to like organization heaven. And what did he do? He put up another rack and hung dresses from the ceiling. This back room needs to be bombed. That's the bottom line, because it's just. Uh, How the hell are we gonna get up there? What are you putting up here? Poofies. Poofies, the whole ceiling will collapse. It's reinforced. Uh, the, the reinforced my ass. You can't put poofy gowns up there. Our back room looks nothing like Mac's back room. We really need a separate area and, and a bigger warehouse than what we currently have to see what we have. Everything's all crammed in. It's definitely time to expand. Glamorous. I love her. Well, tell her tanning's not as important as getting her dress because without her dress, she can't go to prom. OK, bye-bye. They don't want to try on their dresses. Oh, I have to go tanning. It's a little more important than trying on my prom dress. Hello, without the dress, you can't go to prom. What did I miss in Chicago? How was it? Do you see his Lamborghinis? Do you drive his nice cars? Mac is the best. You know what I love about him? He is a businessman. He's a family man. He's a spiritual man. All right, what kind of cars do you have? I'm talking about spiritual meditation. Are you talking about cars? Yeah, I want to know what kind of car he drove. It was a car after car after car. It was picked us up in a stretch Hummer. Then he picked us up in a Rolls Royce. Then we went and. And he had the Lamborghinis there. He was like... Lamborghinis? Yeah. Then, the best part was, we went to the showroom. The warehouse in the back, it's like rows and rows of thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of dresses. Now, we have to go and open up our own, build something ourselves. That's the ultimate goal. Just me and you, bro. This is it. This is what I'd like to open. A.E.K. and company. This is what I'm thinking here. <laughs> you do, like, you have here... Are those supposed to be people? Mannequins. So you have the waiting and reception area here. Then you have alterations back here. Then you have, like, uh, MOB, special occasion. So separate the prom from the mother And then rubs. you have prom. Yes. And, like, juniors, like, Sweet 16. This is taking it from mom and pop to, like, a real organization. We can have a sketching area. You can do appointments. It'll be a little more organized. Yes. Look what we got by working together as a family. We could get from A to B, now we go from B to C. You're right. Chrissy, are you going to get back to your normal ways of cooking for us? Somewhat, hopefully. We're all at Kim Lee's house for family dinner. Francesca, you have macaroni already on your toes. We try to get together about once a week. You know what it is? We haven't had a home-cooked meal in so long. Every night, it's like working late, working late, working late. It was like, let's just cook. So what happened in Chicago? What did you just do? What happens in Chicago stays in Chicago. Chicago.